business owners are being targeted by crooks in Westminster, but it's not their shops that are being hit. Well, police say it's their homes. Denver 7's Claire Lavazorio shows us how the victims are leading burglars right to their front door. You know, you can never be too cautious. Unfortunately, that is the world that we live in today. It hasn't taken long for word to spread among Westminster businesses about burglars targeting the people who work here. Gina Lucero owns Lucero's Tavern. She says she first heard about the crime trend on social media. This is our livelihood, yeah. It takes one rock, you know? We'd lose everything. Where Westminster police say small business owners are followed home from work and then their homes are burglarized while they're away. They have cash and jewelry in the home, that's what they're looking for. The thieves use simple tech like air tags to track the victims. It's definitely scary knowing that something as simple as an air tag can uh, follow you so easily. And cameras hidden in shrubbery to see when they're no longer home. While it's business as usual today, staff at this Chinese kitchen tells me their owner was one of the victims who was followed and then robbed, leaving those who work and live in this area feeling on edge. They're targeted. They're watched. It could be up to a day, a week, a month. We're not exactly sure how long they're watching them, but they watch them. And then once they leave, they, they do their business. Police are investigating at least eight cases in Westminster. But my most recent one was $50,000 cash was taken. Yeah. Employees at Lucero's Tavern say they're thinking about this every day. And when it's time to leave, no one walks out alone. A small step toward keeping their restaurant safe. Unfortunately, there are bad people and they will do whatever they want for some money. In Westminster, Claire Lavazorio, Denver 7. And who's behind it? Well, so far, police have arrested six Romanian nationals, and they are still searching for more suspects.